Gary here. Ever since I was a kid, and all the way into my late 20s, I had the most pathetic chest you could imagine. I had a huge set of man boobs, and nothing I did seemed to make a difference. I remember looking at all those celebrities, bodybuilders, and fitness models, thinking I would do anything to look like that. But no matter how much I worked out and how hard I tried, my chest just wouldn't take form. I couldn't even get rid of my man boobs, let alone grow a manly set of pecs. I kept thinking that I was too young, that all those guys in the magazines were older than me, that my body would naturally get more muscular as I got older. But shit, look at Taylor Lautner in New Moon. That guy's built as hell, and he was a bloody teenager. Arnold Schwarzenegger won the Mr. Universe title at the age of 20, and I was thinking I was too young well into my mid-20s. Eventually, I realized I had to be doing something wrong. Being a crazy autistic nerd and science geek, I went out there and tried everything that existed in the world of weight loss, muscle building, dieting, and fitness. It took me a while, but I finally stumbled on a system that would strip away my chest fat and build an impressive set of pecs that make that Lautner kid look like he still drinks milk from his mother's breasts. I'll tell you about this system in the third video of this three-part chest sculpting video series. Meanwhile, while I still had my man boobs, life was miserable. If, as a man, you're not totally comfortable with the way your chest looks, then dude, I know how you feel. Ever since my early teens, I was terrified of taking my top off in public. I used to write sick notes in my mom's handwriting just to avoid physical education in school, so I could avoid being seen topless in the locker room. I stayed home while my family went to the beach and water parks in the summer. Forget being topless, I couldn't even wear a t-shirt without looking like a freak. People would raise their eyebrows and ask me why I was wearing that thick sweater in the hottest month of the year. I was teased and ridiculed by my friends, family, and colleagues. I had no luck with girls, I had no self-esteem, and my life sucked. If you are anything like I was, or you're not totally confident about the shape of your chest, then I have good news for you. When you sort out your chest, when you get rid of that excess chest fat, grow some muscle, and build a powerful set of pecs, your life will change in more ways than you know. Girls will be more attracted to you. You'll be more confident and feel more comfortable about the way you look. But that's just skimming the surface. When I lost my man boobs and sculpted a powerful, wide, manly chest, my level of confidence went through the roof. I felt unstoppable. For the first time in my life, I was the dominant guy in the group. I was no longer afraid of expressing my views or putting myself out there. I became more sociable and more outgoing. I made new friends and developed a better relationship with my colleagues and even with my boss. It wasn't long before I got a raise at work, made great new friends, and had a hot new girlfriend. Imagine how it would feel knowing that you look great in anything you choose to wear. What it would feel like to have hot women checking you out for a change. What would it feel like if people just automatically treated you like a VIP? Seriously, having a powerful chest gives you presence. Remember that scene in Leonardo DiCaprio's Catch Me If You Can when he walks into the airport with all those hot stewardesses? Everyone is checking the girls out and wondering who the lucky guy is. That's the kind of presence I'm talking about. The kind of presence that'll make people stop and ask, who the hell is that guy? Wouldn't all of that just automatically make you feel more confident? And couldn't you take that confidence and improve your relationships? Might that confidence help you to land a better job and a better standing in life? Hell yeah. The secret to success isn't your IQ, intelligence, or level of education. As Daniel Goleman says in his groundbreaking book, The Leading Determinant of Success Isn't IQ, It's EQ, Emotional Intelligence, which is all about how you feel about yourself and how you relate to other people. It isn't some shit that you were born with, like the size of your brain. The best, most powerful way to change the way you feel about yourself, increase your EQ, and improve your life is to sculpt a truly powerful masculine physique. But yeah, I know, it's easier said than done, right? The fitness industry is a mess, and it's getting worse day by day. We have no idea where to go for help these days. Everywhere you look, someone's trying to make a quick buck off you. There's people out there selling crazy potions and all this acai berry shit. There are more fitness experts out there today than ever before, and each and every one has his own training method that he swears is the best. 
Now, being the crazy shit that I am, I really have gone out there and tried almost everything. I even lived and trained with Buddhist monks for a whole year. How's that for extreme? When I got the results I wanted on myself, I knew that I still had a lot more methods to test, so I got a science degree, became a fitness instructor, and started testing on other people. If I listed everything I've tried, you'd be here all day, so I won't do that. Instead, I'll tell you what I learned. Most of the thousands of different methods out there don't work for shit. All the crap you see in fitness magazines, celebrity-endorsed training programs, late-night infomercials, all a bunch of scams. There are, however, quite a few different methods that will get you some impressive results when it comes to losing chest fat and sculpting a manly set of pecs. But you and me, we don't care about all the methods that work. What we care about is, what is the single best method? Which one method will get me the results I want in the quickest time possible with the least amount of effort? Well, you might discover this method if you spent over a decade trying different stuff out like I have. But why waste years of your life when you can just take it from me and sculpt the body of your dreams in just a few short weeks? I have even more good news for you. You don't have to just take it from me. There are a number of long-forgotten superstars who had discovered and used the same principles and the same secrets that I have. I'll tell you about these guys in video 2 of the three-part chest sculpting video series, so stay tuned. These superstars are just the kind of role models we need today, at a time when we men are forgetting who and what we are. Not only are we becoming more and more submissive and less dominant as men, but our bodies are no longer the ripped, muscular, rock-like structures they were back in the old days. As time goes on, we're becoming more and more feminized, not just in our behavior, but in our bodies. You've probably heard on the news that male fertility is under threat, because our sperm counts are dropping like a brick. Studies have shown they've decreased by a third since the 1990s. That basically means that the average guy your age back in the 90s was biologically three times the man that you are. Now don't you think you should do something about that? And it's not just our egos on the line here. Hell, the human race could be facing extinction because we men are literally morphing into women. Also, man boobs are more common today than they ever were before. Back in the day, I'm talking tens of thousands of years ago, most guys used to be ripped and muscular. That was our natural state. Now it's becoming more and more difficult for us to get into shape. With chest sculpting, I'm here to show you the way back to masculinity. After over a decade of testing and research, I've discovered the things that are robbing us of our masculinity. Chest sculpting is the cure to the modern disease of feminization. I've already helped hundreds of guys lose their man boobs and even more to lose chest fat lose generalized body fat, build muscle, and get into the best shape of their lives. And if you're reading this, I want to tell you that I'm here to help. Helping other guys to get into shape, sculpt a masculine physique, and finally gain control over their lives is my passion. I really do look forward to the day when you email me with your success story. And to help you along, I'd like to ask you a question. What do you think is your one biggest obstacle to sculpting the body of your dreams? What's the one thing that's holding you back? Maybe it's a lack of information, bad genes, a lack of motivation, a lack of time to commit to diet and exercise, not enough money to join the gym. Maybe you don't think it's possible without pills or surgery. You can email me or hit me back in the comments section below. Now, I'll do my very best to answer your questions directly, but the community's gotten real big lately, so I can't promise to get to each and every one of you. What I will do is take some of the most common questions and post answers for them in the next video. So that's it with this video. I've kept it short, but the next one's going to have a lot more meaty stuff in it. I'll be telling you about what's maybe the single most important factor that's holding you back from achieving the body of your dreams. I'll also reveal a long forgotten class of athlete who can help you cut through all the crap you see on the fitness scene today and show you exactly how you must train for the quickest transformations possible. Don't miss it, man. I'll see you then.